Hello, 5W Family! Aí, galera, tô trazendo umas dicas bem legais aí pra vocês, tá? Fiquem ligados! Hello, everyone! Long time no see, huh? I know, I know. I've been away for a while, but I'm back now. Okay, today I'm going to teach you some winter expressions because, you know, it's winter. All right, so let's see the first one. The first expression I'm going to show you is to bundle up. Okay, to bundle up. What is to bundle up? It's the same thing as to dress warmly. Okay, it's like to put a coat on if you're cold. So, uh, for example, today I am wearing this coat and um, whenever you feel cold, you have to bundle up. Okay, let's check the example. Bye, darling. Don't forget to bundle up. It's really cold outside. These kids. All right, got it? Cool. Let's go to the next one. The second one that I'm going to show you is to put something on ice. Okay, to put something on ice. What would that be? It's the same thing as to, to delay something, to stop something. So, for example, you're working on a project and you want to delay it. You want to stop it because you have to do something else. Right? Let's check the example. Man, I think we should put the project on ice for a while. I've been really busy lately. Nice one. Got it? Let's see the third one. The third expression is when hell freezes over. Okay? When hell freezes over. What is that? It's the same thing as never. Not in a million years. Not a chance. Okay? So let's see the example. Dude, you know when she'll give you a chance when hell freezes over. Whoa, that's a cool one. Let's see the next one. Okay, the fourth expression is to break the ice. It's a really common expression here in Brazil, even in Portuguese, right? So what is the meaning of to break the ice? When you don't know exactly how to start off a conversation, so you've got to break the ice. You have to say something to make the beginning the conversation. Let's check the example. Come on, man. Say something. You gotta break the ice. Hey, did it hurt? What? When it fell from heaven? That's a cool one, right? Let's check the fifth one. Okay, this next example is to walk on thin ice. Okay, walk on thin ice. What would that be? It's the same thing as to be doing something risky or dangerous without thinking about the consequences. Okay, let's check the example. Hey Scott, man, you're walking on thin ice. If you get late again, you'll be fired. Yeah, pay attention to that one. Okay, this last one is the tip of the iceberg. Tip of the iceberg. We have some of these expressions in Portuguese, so it's not that hard for you to understand or memorize them. So, what is the tip of the iceberg? It's something superficial or the surface of something, just a small part, a small fraction of a subject, of a topic that you're talking about, or a story, whatever. Let's see the last example. No, man. All these things you're showing on TV are just the tip of the iceberg. There's a lot more to be found out. Well, that's it for today, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, this video was 100% in English for you to train your listening skills and um, I will be posting more videos right now. And I still owe you some videos that I promised uh, a few days ago. I'll do that, I promise. See you guys around.